Hello there SMR gang and welcome to this exclusive video for you guys. I got invited into this new game. It's called Project Exhibited. It's a game that is going to be the new Thief slash Dishonored game. I have no idea but we will find out together. I got an invitation from the developers. They wanted some alpha tests so this is going to be an exclusive content especially for you guys. I have no idea what's going to happen. As you can see, I cannot change change any settings. I cannot load the game. I can only select the mission and that's it. That's because it's still in the alpha process right now. We are going to play this game. We are going to review it and give these developers some feedback on the game. What's good, what's not good, what needs some improvement, what's also a very good thing in the game. Um, as you can hear, there's no background music right now. I'm going to put it silent on the video. As you can hear, it's totally blank. So maybe in the game it's going to be different. We will see. All right, guys, let's check it out together. Mission select. Hello, Dana. Welcome to Malta. Agent, the bidding will begin in a few days. We must secure the artifacts in time to meet our deadline. We need you to break into the palazzo and steal a valuable art artifact for us. We managed to sneak a few pictures during the its renovation to help you out. Don't forget, this is a solo operation. There is no rescue mission set up. Know that the palazzo is crawling with security personnel and CCTV cameras, so be careful. After stealing the asset, escape the premise and have it delivered to us. Then the next day, you will be given your second assignment. Good luck, assessment. So we have three pictures. We need to steal that vase or the artifact. It's a studio room and that's the outside of the building. And the mission is called The Shockening. Alright, let's see. You can't fight the guards, you will have to run away. Let's keep that in mind. Oh, it's a heist. So we see a... Oh, it's a, it's a garden. Okay, cool. Oh, we heard something, some sound. Oh, that's, that's the artifact that we need to steal. Okay. Oh, and don't forget to use the Polaroids we gave you. Press tab to open them. Agent Dana, tonight's objective is a Chinese vase. A picture of it is attached in this message. The vase is located on the top floor. There are multiple paths to reach it, but you should be able to fall through a window and climb the scaffolding to reach the room. Best of luck, Thieves Guild. And we get the same pictures again. Alright. So, we just need to run through. Oh, we get pop-ups. Press tab to view mission brief. Sure. Tab. Hmm. We have a light button. Oh, it's a power box. Looks like a disabled power box for the camera. Okay. So it's disabled so they don't see us. That's good. And collect all vases laying, lying around the palazzo. And we collected $100. Spacebar. Ooh. Oof. That that's a weird mechanic. I can't move. It's that grate is my itself. way out of here. Once I got the vase, I should escape through there. Gaben, is this you? That's. Oh. Okay. So I just need to walk with WASD. That's still the no same thing. The mission is to steal the objective. That we got a mission from. Press control to crouch underneath objects like scaffolding. Sure. Tastes so bad. Anyways, I'm going back to my position. Keep your eyes on the garden. Yeah, all right. I'll move once I'm done. Okay. They are talking like robots. <laughs> oh, we can sh shock them. What <laughs> rip? Look at the legs. Oh, we see our own leg. Ooh. Lol. Poor guy. <laughs> nope. Um, do we need to go here? I have no idea. I think so, yeah. Let's go down. Uh, as I was telling you guys, um, the developers are Thieves Guild. Project Thieves, actually. They are a new company. Um, they started developing this game, I think, around three years ago. And they were looking for some people that want to test their alpha game. I think the team consists of 20 developers, something like that. 
they all study it study it for that stuff to do so I'm actually eager to find out what's how the main game is going to be when it's out of alpha because I really think it has some potential just going from what I can see right now as you can look on the in the build um, in the sky a lot of stars the, the textures are okay they have somewhat of a bush it's not completely filled it has gaps in it but you know it's it's an alpha we need to look straight through that so it's also one of my first alpha reviews that i ever that i ever have done i never got an invite so i'm really 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 eager to find out what we can do so we can run by pressing shift but we want, don't want to do that because they can hear us then we need to put that we need to shut off that camera okay let's run through anyway what's what, what's gonna happen if he sees me he doesn't see me he doesn't see me yo 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 why doesn't he see me you can see <laughs> their holes you know that, that's 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 a bad thing for the ai in my opinion it sucks that they don't see you would be would be more realistic if they actually saw you through the holes would actually make more sense we need to shock this okay done it's also annoying as you can see the on top of me shock glove it's still standing there like the, the text box it doesn't disappear at all i think it's like a permanent reminder that you need to shock the guardian uh, the cops i don't know man anyway we managed to shut down the first camera the guard is here so we need to watch out there's a vase on top i'm not eager to f get that right now okay camera is still here we need do we need to close shut down no okay we're good um yeah i'm really wondering how the main game is going to be is it going to be just a stealth game like this is there going to be fighting i i have no idea for now and that's another camera good let's run through you can hear them walking that's but i find it a very hard time to locate the footsteps oh wait he sees me look oh what he what he isn't seeing me because there was a circle and when the circle is there he sees me you see so they only react if they see you for a certain amount of time then i suppose make ah, okay i'll take it you know another face nice let's continue I think if they added some some music in the background, it would be more pleasant to play like a, not a dark background song, but just a little bit more tense music, you know. That would that would be really really cool, actually. Can we go underneath? Yeah, we can. Wait. What? Shit. He saw me. <laughs> no. And we're dead. We're dead. Okay, restart. No way, we have to do it all over again? Do we really have to do it all over again? Okay. We know what to do. Let's do it real quick. That sucks, that's man. great is my way out of here. Once I got the vase, I should escape through there. That's that's a bad thing. Like there's no the checkpoint or whatsoever. So Anyways, I'm going back to my position. Keep your eyes on the garden. Yeah, all right. I'll move once I'm done. <laughs> Voila. I know it's a stealth game and they need need to make it challenging else it would be boring as hell to play the game but 
I don't know. I, th I think they really need to add that. Oh, wow. Is he going to see me? <laughs> he just, he just passes me. They, they're like, nope, I don't want to work here. I'm just going to walk around and do nothing. Like, bruh. That's not cool. I can't jump if there's no latch, so I cannot jump on the bush for some reason. Does the camera stay on? Yeah, okay. I'm just gonna run. I don't really care. Since they don't really pay attention to me, I can just run through, actually. That's okay. I'll take it. So, what do you guys think of this game so far? Let me know in the comment section. What do you think is good? What's less good? What do you want to see differently in this game? For me, I think I want more uh, intelligent AIs. Like, when you're in their area of, of, of watching or whatever the name is. Like, the eye radius. Where they can see you in real life as well. I think that's that's more realistic and more cool to play now it's actually too easy you just need to wait until they turn around and crouch through the space that's it like yeah i don't know i'm just gonna run up if that's possible okay there are a lot of cops but we're fine for now. And also... We can crouch... Pretty low to the ground and we're also moving quite fast for it, like... Oh, there's a gap between the door. I don't know if it's meant to be or not. But you can see through the door. Okay, I'll take it. Oh, he's coming to us. Is he going to see me underneath the table? <gasps> he can't see me. I, f I, think, I think that's normal. I think that is normal, that he can't see me. It makes sense. So, is it going to be the new Thief game, the zombie game? I think they have the potential for it. Look, he, he didn't see me. <laughs> he didn't see me. As you can see, there's a, a time counter on it. It, I think it's like they're stunned for 50 seconds and then they get back to life. I guess it's something like that. Oh wait, this is a studio room, no? Yeah, yeah, we, we, yeah, yeah, okay, 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 okay. We found the studio room, that's really good. Can we go up? No, we can't. What's this right here? Wait, 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 wait. Okay, this is the garden. Should be able to throw away a climbing scaffolding and reach the room. Okay, we went up there, then we... We were with the... Studio room, so I think I'm on the right track. I think the vase is, is inside. Oh, my head. <laughs> my head Yeah, because you got shocked and that's all you care about my head You're not like huh what happened to me who killed me or who shocked me The vase I don't think the vase is in here anyway Actually, I, I think I'm wrong. I think I just need to proceed Yeah, 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 I need to proceed. I need to. Okay, fair enough. Let's go downwards. <laughs> I think this game has potential. Yeah. There oh, I'm just out of sight. But the hands are also in a weird spot. Like, why is it... So they're like... He's walking all like this all the time. 
All crammed up. Okay. I hear footsteps close to me. I have a feeling that I'm wrong. I... Like there's a hidden box or something. I can't run through. Okay. Stupid tree. They need to add more intelligent AI to do this. They're cops. They're trained to, to find people. And here the smallest step as well. Okay, it it needs to be doable for the player, but like here, if you're a trained cop, he sees you. No matter what. And he almost caught me. He sees me. I think if they are going to add a difficulty setting, then it's it's really good. Then it's really good. If they they just need to add a difficulty. You can also run away from them. That's something we learned from now. Oh fuck. My language, sorry. Please don't look here. Please don't come to me. Okay. Do we need to go up here? I'm not sure. I think we need to go through the door on the right side. I hear a clicking sound, but I have no idea why there is a clicking sound. Now I'm just going back to the place where I was before, right? Yeah. I'm back at the spot that I, uh, that I used to be. So I need to be here. For sure. Hmm... I need to go through that door, right? Okay, let's try that. Let's try and go through the door. Just use these bushes. He can't see me. Run around. I need to stun him. Else I won't make it. Okay, that's one down. Okay, he's going to the other sides. As you can see, the, the energy is also regenerating to shock cops. Which also makes sense, in my opinion. But it's it's a long uh, reload time, I think. So... I What's going on? took a look around this area. Area. And... I think we just need to be up here. I'm such a dork. Okay. We are inside the building once again. Let's see if we can get to the vase, obviously. Well, I do have to point out that the the structural design of the buildings are quite nice, like even though it's only an alpha, some textures are really well done. Really well done. Okay, I'm gonna shock him. That's one down. What's going on? I need to shock this guy as well. I don't know if can I wait wait. If I can abuse the view kill the view, I can hit him from here without noticing what? me. What happened to you? Uh, what happened? <laughs> Yo, yo, yo. I can't chuck him? I can't chuck him? I can't. I can't now. No. That's weird. When you're standing next to him and your shock gets refilled, you're not able to shock him for some reason. You can only shock some someone if the white bullet on your screen turns to red. Else it won't work. In another phase. I would like to see a counter on top of the of the, the game where it adds up the amount of value that you that you have collected. I think this is oh, it's not unfinished business. The floor is hmm, buggy. I think we have entered an unfinished. Oh, we almost got spotted. 
<gasps> I think we're close to the vase, boys. I think we're close to stealing something. They're taking a look at empty glasses. <laughs> like, <laughs> why? Why would you do that? I also like the, the camera thing that he sweeps around as well. I think he's more intelligent than the than the cop. Oh. Shit. Oh wait, the camera doesn't see me. What? Okay, I need to need to shock him ASAP. Right on time. Get in the vent. Maybe there's something I can do. Turn off the camera, maybe. Yeah, nice, nice, nice. Let's go. A lot of vases as well. Money. I need to wait, wait for my shock. Kaboom. He's like... Maybe he, he gets oh, shocked thro throughout his body. <laughs> Who knows? Okay. Proceed. Can just run around, I think, right now. We're back. Wait, wasn't... I ran around. Dude, I literally ran around. Are you kidding me? It's really hard to see where you need to go to, like... There's no direction, arrow, or whatsoever. That's weird. Okay, let's just chuck him. Get back outside. But on this side this time. Yep, okay. Man, I ate too many beans. I don't feel so good. <laughs> this guy. <laughs> this guy. <laughs> Lol. This guy. <laughs> oh my god. He farted. That was disgusting. I hope it was a real fart, you know. <laughs> oh my goodness. I like that. It's good good humor. I, I'll take it, you know. Just gonna enter the room without giving a damn boot. Let's kill the camera. Huh? What's wrong? Huh? What's wrong? I turned off the camera. Hmm. Developers, if you need someone to speak or uh, talk as a voiceover, contact me. I'm willing to to be a cop for you guys. It was always always my dream to be a voice actor. Always. Can we go outside? I guess we can. Is he still knocked? <gasps> oh, we got the vase! We got the vase! We stole the vase! Nice, 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 nice. Now we just need to... Oh, shh. Now we just need to... Escape. <gasps> the camera is working again. No, 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 no. Don't do this to me. Okay, we're in here. Can we? No, we can't go like right there. Okay, he's just running around. Let's not rush things. We're so close to escape at the vase. We're so close. We can do it, boys. We can do it. But where is the exit, though? Where is the exit? Where is the exit? I can see the exit marker right there, but... I have a feeling they increased the cops. 
Okay. I'm getting stressed. I need to escape. Oh, there's a cop here, I think. Yeah, there's a cop right there. Where is where is the exit? There's an exit right there, so I guess I just go this way. Just gonna let him turn around. Okay. Proceed. I want to know what happens if we manage to escape anyway. I think we escaped. We escaped. GG. So this is the screen that you get. You get mission 1 base basis score. I think it should be base score. Money collected. Okay, I got 1.8k mon money. I shot 22 guards. I disabled 0 cameras. I thought that I disabled multiple cameras actually so i think that's a a tiny bug right there i got four, detected four times i discovered zero bodies i played 1016 seconds i guess or minutes hmm that's weird i'm aggressive okay i'll take it i got final score of 80k nice Vase stolen from luxurious villa. This vase being one of remarkably high value. Though the exact number has not been shared with the press. These guards and the owners say to have been overwhelmed by the inventiveness and unique approach the perpetrators took. Many guards were seri seriously injured by usage of some electronic device. The people were seemingly indiscriminately taken out when they were standing in the way of the violent criminal. No, they weren't. <laughs> they weren't. Alright, we actually finished this alpha game right now. Alright guys, um, I'm going to give a small review on this one. Um, let me give you the pro first. What I do like is the concept of the game. It's a stealth game where you need to sneak around the cops and you need to be patient to get to the main objective, which is actually quite good. Um, I like the graphic design in the game. That's something I really liked as well. Um, what else did I like? The, the electronic device on his arm. That's a cool feature as well. Um, what, what is okay, I'm neutral about the controls. They're like mess, press spacebar and you automatically jump. You don't need to move anymore, you can do a thing. Um, the timer on the electronic device is okay-ish um, I think they need to add more features to the to the glove like you can do more than just shock the enemies but maybe I'm playing um, thinking too aggressive like other game modes I don't know it's something I, I, I really think about um, what else um, but it's also neutral oh no what I also liked yeah also a pro, uh, a pro is um, the cameras like they're sweeping around looking for me. That's also a, a very good feature that they added. Uh, what they need to increase or improve, in my opinion, is um, difficulty of the game. Okay, the guards can uh, see you and you can sneak away from them. That's okay. But I think they need to add a difficulty from easy, normal, hard to uh, a thief level. I don't know, whatever you want. But it's also, they see you and then after a period of time, they don't remember anyone being in the building. They need to be like, oh, we saw somebody, we need to call the other guards. And other guards are coming from another area and making it more difficult. But I think it's something you can increase according how far you progressed into the game, I guess. Uh, yeah. I think this is my main review for now. Um, if I'm going to rate the game right now, as the state of today, um, I would give it, story-wise, 
I will give it an eight, eight and a half out of ten. I like the, I like really like the concept. They put a lot of work into it. It's it's a really cool thing. Um, graphics, it's unfinished. I'm not gonna give it a number. It's it's stupid uh, because it's an alpha game, obviously. Controls, uh, five out of ten for me right now. It's too sturdy, too rusty. Um, I'm used to have a fluent control. I don't know. Um, but I played it for free. If this game is getting released on Steam, I will support the developers by buying this game because it's a new developer team, a new company. You need to give these guys a chance. And I think they really can manage a lot if they have the financial to do so and the time. So I'm going to close off, close off this review with a positive note. Guys, you're doing a great job. Keep going. Um, and for all my viewers, if you cannot wait for this game um, to get released, comment down below in the comment section what you've liked about the game, what you didn't like, what do you want to see improve. Also, you can write feedback down below in the comment section. That's also a possibility. Just let us know. In the name of Project Thieves, I thank you very, very much of, to watch this video, to go on this Steve mission with me and listen to this review. You guys are so amazing. All right, that's Amar gang. I would like to thank you very much and I'll see you guys next time. But don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Goodbye.